Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to Made with Unity Mondays for the 15th of August 2022 where I feature some of the best games, creations and everything made in Unity. And be sure to submit to me if you have any awesome creations. Check out all the links in the description for all the best savings and everything that you can find in game dev. Also check out my Patreon to get access to another 150 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Number one, we have Halo Badger, which is a snippet to his full trailer, which you can find in the links below. Hackman's has got real-time afro hair, which was really, really important for the short film that he's creating. Emre Khan has got the Terrain Decorator, which is a ter open source terrain tool, which is hoping that somebody can finish it for him. That Surge has got a game called That's a Cow. It's out now, and I don't really know what to think about it. Sergio Rodriguez has got at how it started and even when solo devving can be really tough. Dave Baz has got progress of a combat system which you might actually scrap. I think it looks so smooth. A Dush to Dush has got a brand new dash area of effect, which I think looks absolutely incredible. Olix Oliver has got an analog post processing effect featured in the back rooms, as if it could get much worse. Code for Broke has got AI that responds to crimes, but he didn't program any factions, so it's just all out madness. Ultramarine Afterglow has got one lonely planet. 40k entities and experimenting with ECS gravity systems. Dragon Name has got a first showcase of the multiplayer FPS which has been working on for around 3 years and the map looks kinda familiar. Yamo Studios has got some brand new visual effects for this week, which they always do. And be sure to check out an awesome asset called iStep, which is a foot placement solution for Unity, and it's an ability to be able to make sure foot placement is perfect upon any surface that your character places the foot along. Put the link in the description. Kill the Radio has got a brand new water system for their Water Dinosaur DLC, and it's really satisfying. Saldev has got some movement with a grappling hook, which just accidentally turned into this. Chunky Rab has got seven days until the launch of Rollerdrome. Unity have got their brand new showcase using Speedtree, Weta Digital, Ziva, and lots of other features to create their little lion demo. Mirror Rico Games have been working really hard on a major boss with some stunning visual effects.
Game of the Year and Best Narrative for Unity Games, The Rise Home Stories. Future underscore account 6129 has got 5 months of development as a team of 2, 1 artist and 1 programmer and this is what you can create. Ollie129 has got scanning cars which he finds oddly satisfying. The fate of Boulder has got a brand new weather system. Conradicalissimo thinks Paper Mario wasn't what it was, created their own Paper RPG. Mantis FRK has got a war staff against the Bridge Guardian. Ilyseva has got some VR jewel wielding with all the style. So big thank you to all the developers for making some awesome creations. Be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the best savings across game dev, humble and more. Come and join my Patreon to get access to over 115 different scripts, projects and assets you cannot find anywhere else. And be sure to check out my assets on the Unity Asset Store along with the massive updates that I've been doing recently and on my website for bonus discounts. Big thank you to all my patrons including Peter Steiner, Holgan Nigan, Raheem Whitaker, Jean Pomier, Manos Berikas, Terence Conrad, Gage Linston, Walter Dunson, Joseph Newman, Rene Leisure, Topher Chambers, Kreshnik Halili, Christian Sellen, Benjamin Shankel, Alex Shen, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Getterjank, LeBrons, Stephen Mormon, Rob Winkle, and BJ Pickles. So thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.